Hey everybody, it's Morgana Hilver here. I know it's been a couple days, i just not been feeling so good, but I'm back. You're actually going to be very happy that I did not post my last video. Um, because I was really upset about something that happened with a really close friend of mine. And um, he's probably going to see this, so I'm hoping that he doesn't get mad. But I'm not going to say who it was because that would just be just weird. But anyway, I had this like emotional breakdown, okay? Like I had taken so much in real life. We're talking like, you know, my health concerns, my ankle, my kids, my family, um, that anniversary that I forgot. Um, just like tons of things and then of course the holidays and you know money not money troubles exactly but you know money is always somebody's trouble so i was taking so much shit in real life that i finally i i i wanted to like talk to somebody and and then i i guess i misspoke or something i don't know what happened but i find i just like snapped okay because the fear of losing this person as my friend is like he, like he's like this like constant in my life right so the fear of losing him just ripped me apart like oh my god i lost my shit like seriously i lost my shit i got i couldn't type it out so i got on a voice recorder and i just laid into him and i told him like you know god help me i'm going crazy and here we are <laughs> <laughs> but after that, <laughs> I recorded this really long video just in pain. And yeah, that was probably not the best thing. <laughs> but I came to my senses and I didn't delete it. It's still there, but I didn't upload it because I figured, you know, people don't want to hear that shit. Well, some people do, but some people don't. And I know a lot of you right now are like, get out of the video. But that's okay. You you have the right to sound like that. Anyway, so I was going to do like this big like um tutorial on how to get rid of the shiny shit on your body and your face. Well, since I actually want to do something else, I am going to tell you how to get rid of the shiny shit on your face and all that fun stuff, okay? But I am mainly going to be doing a tutorial for uh one of my friends on uh, Facebook. Um, I guess one of her friends had told her I had some sort of special HUD or something in SL that makes like a filter Photoshop kind of deal, but I don't. Um, everybody has it, but since not many people know how to access it, I'm going to show you guys. But first, I'm going to show off my quick little outfit here. Uh, here are my Glamistry shoes. Woo! I am wearing nail polish from Dark passion. <laughs> I had to think about that one. Woohoo. Check that out. Okay. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. I'm having like massive issues with my mouse. It's like snagging on shit. <laughs> All right. My tattoo is from Tattoo Mania. There's two of them. There's the one that's on my body, which you'll see once I change that pose. And then you got this one here that goes up there. Now, this is this dress here. I actually, for the first time in a really long time, had to wear panties. And you can actually get those at the same event. <laughs> here, let me see if I can get a close up of those underwears. See? <laughs> all right so i'm actually wearing um jewelry from Bauhaus movement um my mask is actually from Bauhaus. who i better hit talk all right i'm actually going to take my mask off boop, so that way you can see my face maybe there we go Woohoo! face <laughs> i has a face it's a pretty face. <laughs> All right. Sorry, I'm just going a little crazy, but that's okay because I'm allowed. All right. So I'm not sure if one of these have it. Let me check. Nope, not on that one. How about on this one? Is the shiny? Yep, there's the shiniest. Okay. So if you see that you've got some massive shine on your Katawa head, this is actually thanks to somebody on Plurk, um, one of my Plurk contacts taught me how to fix this all right so you get your shininess here see if you have shininess on your face okay either open up your main HUD like the big one 
or you open up your mini HUD. Now, if you want the mini HUD, if you go into the store at Katawa and on the desk, that's usually where it's it's kept. It's like a free box. Um, now, if you have some shininess issues, down here there is this cute little button. It's an X with shininess. <laughs> Click that, and it will take away all the disgusting oil look. <laughs> And for those of you out there that were complaining that the Belize body, I believe there were a few people on Plurk as well as um, my friend said that she saw it on the Secrets site um, a few weeks ago. So here is what you do. I basically just used the exact same thing that um, they told me to do on... Um, let me think about this one. <laughs> I use the exact same concept that uh, Ketawa has. On the skins, uh, uh, whatever this is, pfft, tab, underneath the skins, you'll see this fun little thing. It's like stars. You click it and it will get rid of all that shininess. I believe they have other places that you can do this as well, but that's one that worked for me. Then there's these ones here. If you got the shine going on on your fingernails and you're not wearing a shine, you can click them there as well. Let's see. Do I have it anywhere else? I'm sorry if I burp in your ear. <laughs> if you're having issues with your tattoos and stuff showing, <gasps> pardon me, you can click these fun things here. <laughs> sorry, I just ate like a lot of canned turkey. Ugh. Anyway, um, <laughs> you just play around with these buttons here and trust me, it will work. Uh, took me a while. Like this tattoo here came on and it wasn't blended at all. It looked like jagged little shards and stuff, but not a problem. I just played with my underwear. <laughs> I played with my underwear and it all, it all worked out. Uh, plus you got your articles. I, I don't even know what that is. These outfits and things. I don't know what those are. I just, I don't play with those. All right. So I am using poses from Ooh Studios. <laughs> Ooh. All right. Turn around, lady. No, not like that. It's going to take me a minute to find a good pose. <laughs> oh, by the way, this like outfit, um, my underwear, my tattoos, my, uh, dress, are, I think the dress is from there, are all from anybody. It's like a mesh event kind of, ooh, I like that. I like that pose. I'm going to use that pose because that's kind of kinky cool. All right, so I'm going to get really close on this. All right, so there you have that. And I am going to take a picture. Now, this is for those people out there that are looking for um, an alternative to Photoshop filtering. If you don't have Photoshop, it's okay because if you're on Firestorm, you got it. Well, you got some filters. So you take your snapshot and you wait for an hour for it to <laughs> basically get to the saved point. <laughs> Ay, la, 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 la. See, I... Um, try to use the highest resolution possible for my computer. Oh, there we go. All right, so now we have a snapshot. Now we can open it up so it's big like that. And then over here under, ca okay, you see snapshot, refresh, capture. Now here it says colors. Um, you can change the depth and everything. I don't mess with that. But over here, under all of that crap, <laughs> <laughs> it's not crap, but you know what I mean. Under all that information, you come down here to filter. Okay, so here's the filters. All right, somebody had, I guess, um, told my friend that they thought that this was a Photoshop HUD in Second Life, but it's not. It's just a filter that's attached to the... Um, who hello! <laughs> it's attached to uh, all the... Um, ba -da, ba -da, ba -da. <laughs> all the firestorms. So as you can see, there's very, there's quite a few here to play with. And uh, yeah, I like, I like filters. I like playing with filters. Um, my, oh, I will show you my, um, my, uh, what am I trying to think? I will show you my uh, Photoshop momentarily. Yeah, yeah, that's it. 
Okay, so we're checking out the... Oh God, come on now. Ooh, that's not bad. Okay, I'm not going to show you all of them. Let's go to this one. Uh, what's that? <laughs> I'm not going to show you all of them because then that would like totally mess up going and playing with them, right? So coming back up to this... Damn, that looks funny. It looks like just legs walking around. <laughs> you know what? Let's like take a better picture. All right, let's go. How about like that? My skin is from Glam Affair. Of course, my hair is from Glam Affair and my hair... No, my skin is from Glam Affair and my hair is from Tableau Vivant, which is um, taboo, apparently, and I just say it wrong. Okay, so there's the photo, and we are going to go to... Let's go to soft focus. I know a lot of people like soft focusing. Focus. Focusing. Ay, 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 I suck. All right, so I'm going to open that up so you can see. Ah, uh, yeah, see, it blurs out the face a little too much, so you probably would have to, like, um, do something more like this, you know? Go right up. Hello. Hello. So nice to see you. Hello. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm, like, hooked on Medea. <laughs> you guys must know what that is. All right, let's try that again. Refresh. <laughs> you know, I went to lay down for a nap and it just didn't work. So you still have the soft, you know, dreamy looking photo. <laughs> uh, let's see, what else shall we try? I'm not trying Matrix because that's kind of silly. You got your lens flares and your leaks and stuff like that. And I know that people thought that it was some sort of HUD, but it's really not. See, isn't that cool? That looks so cool. <laughs> Where's the light leak? This is the one that I used a lot in the past. And I know that people thought that this one here was a um, Photoshop. <laughs> Oopsie. Yes, I already have that. Don't you hate like double notices? That's why I've been running around unsubscribing from places because I get these double notices and it drives me nuts. <laughs> do, 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 do. Look at the hourglass. Ah, that one's nice. I like that. I'm just gonna go click that and do 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 do. Come on, save it. Saving to computer. Well, you gotta actually open it up. There we go. <laughs> yeah, I'm weird. What can I say? Did you ever have any doubts that I was strange? Cuckoo, kachoo. Oh, black and white. I think I've actually taken tons of photos in black and white filter on here. Um, I know I did a couple of uh, Tisrael and I. Look at that. Isn't that hot? That is so hot. <laughs> so hot as hell. Get it? Uh. <laughs> All right. So that's that filter. Like, okay. And then you can take the filter off, obviously. Oh, bad trip. That's one I used to love. <laughs> Crazy. Do, Check that out. It's and freaky you know what i ha oh what's this one blown highlights <laughs> oh man i need a nap <laughs> do, 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 do. oh well it's not too bad oh and of course then like i said i have um customized um wind light settings like i've like gone crazy looking for wind light settings and i've removed like a lot like the Torley ones i love Torley, i really really do but uh yeah i'm not into the whole green thing so these are my wind lights and i actually have zipped them up so if you're interested let me know in the comments below and i can if I get enough people that want them, then I will put them on a, I'll zip them up. No, they're already zipped. I will we'll put them onto a upload site or whatever. So they're all like, you can get them anywhere. 
most of them say where they're from, like Isabel, or there's some from Strawberry Sing right there. There are um, Raymond's Places Paris that's already included. The tools are already included. Uh, I believe most of these are... Ew, God, I didn't even realize I still had those. These ones here, I don't like. <laughs> But, you know, like, my Christian's favorites, my Luna Jubilee, Isabella, Iza, I believe it's the same person, uh, the Anna, Anna Lou, uh, some of them are the same, some of them aren't, Trinity Sky, um, J Battle Scars, that's the one I was telling, um, Dead Cell earlier that he'd probably like a lot, they're pretty cool, I don't know if it'll actually f work in here, but, here, let's pull it back a bit. It'd be better to show you downstairs, but, you know. Do, 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 do. Yeah, it'd probably be better downstairs, or, you know, let's take a look at the light. See? This is outside the studio. Ugh! I already have... Oh, wait. No, okay. I don't have that one, but, you know, whatever. Okay, so this is the studio, and these are the, the other lights that I got. Ah, there we go. See the sky? Isn't that cool? Doo -doo -doo -doo. I'm just like running through a bunch of them. Just so you guys can see, you know? I like, um, where are they? Well, Anna Adore, like, I went and researched all, not researched, but searched for all of her uh, when light settings, you know, because <laughs> you gotta have them. <laughs> now, this is like, oh god, a year of collecting different, um, actually, more than a year of collecting different wind light settings. Let's see, where is. La, la, la. Oh, okay, well, there's strawberry. Silent Hill. This is the one that, it's uh, close-ups. She talks about this on one of her videos. Um, I like it. It's just a little too bright. Let's see? That's insanely bright. <laughs> But again, it could be my, um, uh, blah, blah, blah. the thing that I use for lighting. Until Luma Pro is released, which is tomorrow, <laughs> they have a new, um, updated HUD coming out. Actually, that looked pretty. There we go. I'm going to use that. I'm going to move out just a little bit. Do, 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 do. Come back out this way. Refresh. Uh, yeah, Lum Luma Pro is coming out with an updated HUD tomorrow. So if you actually have that lighting system, make sure that you attach it sometime tomorrow. I would say in the evening because, you know, give them time to actually get online and get everything sorted and yada, yada, yada. Um, <laughs> if I can figure it out, I will do some posts. Oh, that looks pretty. <laughs> but, you know... Uh, I just have to go like as things, you know, if I can understand it, then I'm going to, I'm going to post it as soon as I get the update. All right. So guys and girls out there that like tattoo design. Now I have been looking for a tattoo that is just the arms. Oh, who's messaging? Lick dick. What the freaking hell? <laughs> Oh, come on. Show me the profile. I want to see. Oh, it's right there. Oh, for the love of God. Really? What the hell? Oh, my God. It's him. <laughs> All right. Yeah. This is actually one of my friends. <laughs> We've been friends for many, many years. <laughs> I think he's like a... I don't know. I think he's like really young, but whatever. Okay. I love this. I don't like you. Whatever. That's not him. I know who that is. It's like, like crazy, crazy. All right, so he's one of my friends. <laughs> he's gonna like kill me later. This is gonna be so cool. 
<laughs> what was I talking about? Oh yeah, sleeves. I need sleeves. Like we're talking like um oh, retro punk um or you know like you know the the 50s 60s girls the the um oh what were they <laughs> like race girl i don't know the bright colors the bold colors not these muted colors like it seems that a lot of the tattoo places in second life when they think um you know colored tattoos they think muted tattoos is the best and it's not i want something bold there used to be a store called canimal and they used to have like you know what i'm gonna stop taking pictures <laughs> they used to have um these competitions where people would show like you know different styles of tattoos etc etc and they closed down and they no longer have that competition which really sucks because those tattoos were amazing like you know it, it seems weird when somebody says hey we want your best um pixie tattoos or your best flower tattoos or you know or your punk tattoos you know people go out of their way to do it also i want to see if somebody out there can make for the Beliza body um one arm sleeves i don't know if that can be done i mean i know that um signature now has that that you can have it just on one arm um so i'm addicted to my beliza obviously i'm sure you guys have figured this out so i would really love to be able to get a tattoo that i could just wear on one arm or even have two different um tattoos if that makes sense Oh, by the way, here are the bracelets. It's the same on both sides. See? Hey, you know what? That actually looks how, like how I do my nails. <laughs> uh, and here's a necklace. Wee. Okay. So, um, so there's there's the things that I need to help with. One, if you want my wind light settings, uh, leave a comment either on my blog or on my YouTube. And if I get enough people that want them, then I will upload them to the website, and you know you can copy them or whatever. Second, if you guys know of a place that has colored tattoos, we're talking bold colors i don't want this muted crap you know muted reds and muted blues no i want bright colors like you know blood red with like blasting in your face reds and yellows and oranges and greens you know bloody colors <laughs> and just sleeves i just want sleeves and i want to see that's the third thing i want to see if somebody out there knows how to make just one sleeve I really loved when mesh tattoos came out and then all of a sudden they disappeared. I have some mesh tattoos and they're awesome, but I want to do an update, obviously. <sighs> See, he's still talking to himself. <laughs> he gets the same update as anybody. I'm filming. I'm not going to reply. And then people are like, oh my God, she's so rude. She won't talk to me. It's like, yeah, no, I'm kidding. <laughs> All right. And I don't think there's anything else to touch base on. Um, the whole breakdown thing at the beginning of this video, I, I, I'm past it, sort of. I mean, I kind of wish he would talk to me. I mean, he sent me a, a message, but that's it. He hasn't talked to me since. And it's kind of like, oh, God, did I screw up? <laughs> yeah, probably. <laughs> well, you all know me. When I get emotional, I get right... <gasps> savagely emotional it there's no like you know mildly emotional no no my life doesn't work that way i either get really happy really pissed off or really emotional there's no happy medium there is no borderline anything and then you get these assholes on the internet saying people with aspies don't have empathy yeah Fuck you! We have empathy. The problem is, is that we have so much bloody emotion in our heads that we don't know how to process it. There's a difference between not having empathy and having so much that you don't know what to do with it, so you don't do shit.
Me, on the other hand, I feel it and I let it out. Unfortunately, I let it out at the worst possible times. <laughs> Never ever express your feelings when you're sad or upset or pissed off or stressed out. Never. Never do that because all that stress, all that pissed offness, if flows into whatever you're saying to whomever so maybe they'll take it wrong mind you that message that i sent him he didn't have to take it wrong because it was pretty much you know here it is <laughs> i do that ask tis i do it i'm like when i'm talking to somebody um if it's emotional then i am all there i am all there and i'm loud <laughs> And sometimes, yes, I'll let go of something that I shouldn't have or, you know, whatever. But chances are, so have they. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to log out. Uh, this was a little bit more energetic than I thought it was going to be. I hope that tutorial helps my friend on Facebook and anybody else who was interested. And I guess that's it for now. I will see you guys later. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel. There is like a thing over here. Like it's going to be like right in this generalized area. It's going to have um, a video. It's going to have like my video of the day. Actually, I'm going to share a playlist of music that I listen to when I'm wowing. <laughs> and there's going to be like a link to my, my blog. If you press it, it, you can click it and it'll take you there. And there will also be a subscribe button. Yeah, click the subscribe button, please. And feel free to share this video with anybody you want. <laughs> Say, hey, you want to see a really crazy, messed up elf? <laughs> Watch this. All right, I'll see you guys later. Bye.